and welcome to the next episode of Let's Play Aragon. So here we are in the middle of our war with many people. Um, something I need to do over here. Hello, Ukraine. I need to take one of these Lithuanian, um, Ukrainian cores and then release Ukraine. And then they, they have, they have cores all over this stuff, even to into Russia. Like, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. That just sounds great. Uh, all right. So this, Skane finished, um, okay, I gained prestige, great, um, we're gonna come up to, let's see, what, fort level, really? Only fort level two, okay, well that will fall quickly, uh, ooh, let's, yeah, yeah, let's go kill him, perfect, oh, oh, look at that, oh, look at that, look at that, look at that, oh, it's amazing. Okay, uh, peace offer from Denmark. Nope. <laughs> I'm going to hand pick my peace offer. And that's all there is to it. I'm going to take Stockholm, and I'm going to take... Oh, good. Okay, well, you sit there for a bit as the, um, what is it called? The garrison re replenishes. Okay, good. Le we've got Liege, because we have some major overextension. Uh, Zemplin will be fine when we get to 76, which is in two months. Calais is going to be a problem. The Dutch lost their, lost their claim, which sucks. Um, so either we have to sell it to Burgundy or France, um, or we have to court it ourselves, which would cost two, wait, what, well, yeah, I think it would cost 200. Which is a lot. We can't core it right now, even if we had the points, because we're at war with France, and France has a core on the territory. Um, uh, oh, we're not. We don't have to worry about that. They're not going to get through. Okay. Oh, and people are joining the coalition against us, right and left. Uh, okay. Yeah. Sure. You can go there. Ooh. Ooh. Yes, did we add you? Okay, that means we can now add you guys, right? Now that I actually need the Imperial Authority. <laughs> um, but hey, every little bit helps, right? I mean, at this point, not, not really. <laughs> um, we are improving relations in Palatsk, right? Yes, actually, let's... Did we send a gift? No, let's go ahead and send a gift as well. Um, probably won't take much, yeah. We might as well, because as, as soon as this war is over, we're going to want to see if we can get that figured out. And by that, I mean getting Polotsk as a vassal. Uh-huh. Uh, are you... Okay, you've got high relations, yes. Relations, 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 good. Uh, why don't we go improve relations over here? Just to keep them... Yeah, Russia... <sighs> Russia, come on, Russia. Stop rivaling me. Oh, Cardinal. Uh, whoa. Okay, English Mexico declared war on Portuguese Mexico. This could be bad. This could be a war with England. Uh, that's not what I want. I don't want it to happen. Um... Wait, English Mexico declared Portuguese Mexico. I don't like it. I don't like it. I'm really afraid. I am afraid. Okay, well, England's not getting called into the war yet. Uh, oh, are they? They're sieging that back up. So let's take this. We'll split you in half. Take you there. No. Oh, thank you, Netherlands. Uh, new cardinal. Cardinal. Mm hmm Oh, yeah. Don't even try, Denmark. Just give up. Just give up. Uh... Nah, we'll just stick around there. As soon as this place falls... Oh, actually, let's take a look at Lithuania. Uh, okay, so we could take... What, what kind of war score do we have against Lithuania? We have only 30, so would, could we take that? Wait, whoa, 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 let's clear. 
Uh, let's take that, because that is a Ukraine core, not a Plots core. Yes. Okay, so if we took that, that'd be 20. That's nice. Um, then, let's see, we could... Wait, no. They won't take that? They won't... Why not? Uh, okay. Oh, oh, because they still... Wait, is Kiev... Kiev is, Kiev is their capital? Oh, my. Okay. Is that normally the Lithuanian capital? I didn't think so. Uh, okay. Well, I actually... Well, I want more Lithuanian stuff to fall. So, I guess I'm not going to peace out quite yet. Huh. I bet the Commonwealth would not give me access. Yeah, they would not. <laughs> Who are you allied with, even, Commonwealth? You're not allied with anyone. You're just in the Coalition. Uh, but this... Do you even have... You don't have a leader. Uh, but you're making headway on Kiev. Which is nice. Yes. Uh... Oh, we've got a little a little revolt there. You go take care of that, I guess. Uh the garrison is three sixty, so let's see. Let's split you in half, let's take the half without the general, and go kill that. Oh look! They're gonna take care of that for us. No need. <laughs> oh, we are winning so easily. Peace offer from Lithuania. Nope. Uh, yeah, I'm totally just waiting for Kiev to fall, because that'll give us pretty massive war score. No. A revolt in Manitoba. That's nice. Please, England, tell me that you're not being called into the war. You haven't been called into that war yet. Okay, good. Uh, tax it. Oh, Milan, you are our vassal. Just stop. Um, yeah. <laughs> oh. Well. Oh. Really? This is a Cleves core. Oh. And Oldenburg has a claim. Are there any more? I don't think there are any more things. Wait, what's this? Brendenburg has a claim. Oh, but but I need I need cores. Ugh. All right, Kiev. Let's fall. Let's do this. Thirty-five percent. <laughs> oh, this is great. It's just great. Alright, oh, there we go. Oh, Kiev fell. Okay, let's take a look at this. Um, Lithuania, what? No. Scroll up. There we go. Okay, now you'll give me that. And will you return any cores? Um, you will even do that, which is great, because that gives us... That would get rid of the a lot of the distance between borders. Maybe here too, but I don't know... I don't know if the distance has to be between cored provinces, and we have no intention of coring this. Um, how many... How many... Okay, good. That's just a three. This is Ukraine. That's four. Um, ooh. Yeah, because I want them to stay small in terms of base tax, so that they will easily diplo-vassalize. That's, that's what I want. All right. Will you do that? You will. Will you then... See, you don't have... You have an alliance with Denmark, and that's it. So I don't care about the other stuff. Nope, you won't do that. Will you give me any money? You'll give me a little tiny bit of money. Give me that. Okay. So now, Polotsk extra super duper loves us, and they will totally vassalize. <laughs> yes! Oh, amazing. Just amazingness. Um, and in fact, as ally allying them will help us get a good way there. We sent the gift. We have them guaranteed. Uh, we should get a mutual, whatchamacallit, rival. Uh, 
Oh, sure, let's rival Lithuania. That sounds great. Okay, now to... Oh, I don't have a diplomat. Okay, soon. Uh, Oman has left the coalition against us. Well, that's nice. Okay. Waiting for a diplomat to come home. The, uh... Okay, great. Let's talk to Denmark. Okay, so let's... So <laughs> Denmark would release Norway. That's amazing. Wait, would they release Sweden? I just want to see. I'm not going to make them do it. You would totally do it. That's amazing. Okay, but give us Stockholm. Yes, and give us... Um, and then I want you to... Oh, sure. Do that. And then give us these three. Ooh, okay. Well, then don't worry about that so much. Uh, cause these- Oh! Oh, man, they're- Well, 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 well. That's okay, that's okay. We can, instead of this, take that. Ha <laughs> ha! Look at that! Oh, yes, and then we can release, and we can release. Oh, oh, now granted that will- that will take us three over as soon as we do that. Um, cause we're gonna release Ukraine and release these two, but- uh, as soon as we sell these provinces to their claimants, we will then begin integrating them. Just instant. So we'll only be three over for a little bit. Um, wait, oh, we, oh, mm. um, ooh, I don't think we have any other, is this, this is Swedish core, and that's two, but Stockholm's only, uh, you know what, you know what, no, we'll just, we'll worry about the cleave, core, the Cleves core later. Uh, will you give us some money? Great. And that's probably some pretty <laughs> massive aggressive expansion. Yeah. Now, what I don't want to happen is for Great Britain to join the coalition against us. Uh, but, so be it. Here we go. And send demand. Done. Okay. So, first and foremost, uh, no, we won't worry about those because we're going to release people. Yes, I know our overextension is dangerously high. Um, we're actually going to leave... Well, we have to leave those guys there, huh? Um, you, we will split in half. We'll take half of you there. You, other, you plus you. Because we're going to be going to war with the Ottomanis soon. Um... Yeah, and we've got troops there, and we've got troops there, because we've got... Let's see, let's take a look at this coalition. <laughs> yeah, it's, um... It's, uh, it's decent size. It is a decent size. Um... Alright, we have to wait till our diplomats come home to do more fun things. But, yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah... Both of those we're going to release, so we're not going to worry about them. Oh no, Riga joined a military coalition. Wait, uh, France did, okay, that's fine. Uh, Denmark, oh, you know what, we don't need, okay, you can come home from there. You are improving relations in Bourbon, which we also don't need. And you are improving relations in Orléans, which we don't need. There we go, oh, that, that, that works. Uh, an alliance offer from Saxe Lauenburg. No, aren't we? What? Are you not part of the HRE? Huh? I don't know. Wait, why are they not listed as one of my vassals? Or Hamburg? Cleves is? What? Now, wait a minute. Now, wait, 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 wait. This must be a glitch. Yeah, they're not... Oh, wow. They are totally part of the HRE, but not my vassals. Okay, that's news to me. I didn't know that that could happen. Um, all right, we have a free diplomat, so let's go over here. Sell a province. Uh, wait, no, I need to talk to you. Uh, sell economy actions. Sell province main. Why won't you take it? What? 
What? Where'd the core go? Okay, well, at least we've got the cores here and there. What the frack? Um... Okay, well, while we're while I'm thinking about it, I need to go over here and to core this. That makes me mad. Why did that core go away? Do you still have the... I mean, claim. Oh, so you got the claim here. Oh, great. So I just should have taken Normandy instead of Maine. Oh, now, you know what I could do? I could release Provence, and they would take... I mean, they would take both of these. Okay, that's what I'm doing, because I don't want... I don't want to have to pay that much to core. Um... Well, or, but I don't want to... Ah, okay, well, one thing at a time, one thing at a time. I should have checked that. Okay. No, 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 declare war. <laughs> I'm just so, so used to doing that. You, will you pay me a little money for it, even? Oh, yeah, you'll pay me 60. Great. Uh-huh. Okay. Uh, and you... Wait, do you know? Yeah, no, that's that's it for their claims, right? Yeah, that and that. Okay, so cool. Uh, sell province. Bury. How much will you give me? Oh wow, you will give me a decent chunk of money. Okay. All right. Um. Yeah, because the problem is if we do that, we'll go way. We would just go super. Super duper over our limit. All right, you know what? We're selling. We're selling that province. We're selling it back to France. You'll take it for free. Fine. Okay. Um. And we'll sell this one back to Burgundy. <laughs> You'll even give us twenty ducats for it. Yeah, I just want to get rid of my overextension. Uh, okay, Stockholm, Volhynia, ah, yes, okay, I was like, what, why do I have another one, okay, um, so first of all, you go here, let us begin, well, let's see, are you, alright, that's being cored, why are you not coring, well, we know we can, you can, you can annex you, Annex. Great. And then we'll go here. Uh, okay, and we can annex as soon as we get to January 10th. Annex Vassal. Great. Uh, you are still not working to core that. I need you to do this. Uh, Plotsk. Let's offer you an alliance. Great. Uh, as soon as we get up to 190, you will vassalize, which is fabulous. Um, I'm not. I'm not liking the fact that I'm not seeing. Cause see here, currently working to make it a core, but here, no, they're just perfectly content uh, to let it just be. Mm. Oh, I have a decision. What's this? Um. Good. Great! I just gain things. Okay, cool. Uh, all right. Well, while we're while we're at this, let's go ahead. What are? Why are you just standing there? You should not be just standing there. You should be walking this way. Okay. I I want I want to see them starting to core. You know what? Whatever. Let's just begin annexing. If it's too bad, it's too bad. Um, hmm, all right, time to release vassals. Well, no, well, yes, the, um, Scandinavian ones, I suppose, or, yes, yes, it is, it is time, because that's adding to our, um, overextension. Uh, where, no, it's here, here we go, create vassal, let us create the vassal of... I'm looking for Norway and Sweden. Sweden! Create vassal. Done! Create vassal. N Norway. Done! Awesome! Now Denmark is not still not in the coalition against me. Kind of amazing. Okay, you're still not in that war. Whatever, whatever that silly war is down there. 
yes, I know I'm over my limit, and I'm going to be for a little while, but so be it. Really, that's the timer. Okay. Well, we're gonna... I'm gonna get to the point... I thought I told you to stop. Okay. Um... I'm just... I'm gonna wait till I get to the point that I can diplo... Vassal... Whoa, 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 whoa. Uh... Lo I'll lose five prestige. Sure. It doesn't really matter. Um... The Ottomans sent a warning to the Commonwealth. Okay, sure, whatever. Um... Morale of armies, that sounds great. Uh, the next one is Leader Siege, which is even better. Okay, come on, just get to 190. Ah, I bet if we... Actually, if we'd returned more land, uh, that would have improved more. Royal Marriage offer from Sweet... Oh, yeah, of course. Yeah, oh, well, duh. And let's... Royal Mary Norway 2. Uh, Dynastic Actions. Royal Marriage. Yeah, that looks great. Mm hmm And as soon as we do that, then we will re release Ukraine as well, which will put us three over. Uh, okay, fine. Uh, and, and as soon as Polotsk is our vassal, then it won't matter that they're on this list. Um, actually, the Commonwealth is on the list? What's the deal here? Oh, they're in a Regency Council. Huh. But I bet they wouldn't marry me. No. No, they would not marry me. <laughs> Big surprise there. Uh, occupied by Lithuania. What is... Oh, that's the Livonian Order? There's a little... There's a little war here. Oh. Well, not so little, because Denmark's in it. But that's fine. All right, come on. Just get to 190, and we'll take care of that. Uh, how far are we... Ooh, our truce is out. Ho ho ho! Our truce is up, which means the next episode is going to be fun with the Ottomans again. Mm-hmm. Come on, one more month. There we go. Uh, all right, let's take care of this first. All right, and offer vassalization. There we go! Sweet! Okay, and now we will create another vassal, and we want this one to be Ukraine. Awesome! So let's see. Ukraine has cores... Oh, yes! Ukraine has cores all over here, which would actually connect back to our land, um, which is pretty amazing. Where Are we overextended? We are, but we're coring everything. Okay, so we're okay on that. Um... Yeah, so there's the Ukrainian cores. Polotsk cores are all up in there. So that will actually, like, create this huge bulb into Eastern Europe for us. Uh, Norwegian cores are all over here. Yes, actually, is that English land? Uh, that is, no, okay, no, that's, that's still Danish land. Uh, Norwegian cores are all up here. Swedish cores are all up here. So Denmark will be left with just just like modern Denmark and Finland um, yeah wow that's pretty awesome uh, Finland is not going about doing anything at all no alliances no royal marriages no claims no nothing uh, which to me seems really quite quite silly uh, oh let's take a look at the religious oh the Mamluks just have completely and Iraq just done you know totally totally done um, <laughs> huh, you still have, uh, Karakoinlu, yeah, you're still a protectorate, I don't understand how that happens to be, um, why is that colored like that? Religion in the province Catholic? Really? Does, does Catholicism spread some into those, into, like, the Eastern religion places? I, I don't, I'm actually not super familiar. Um... Yeah. But also this thing where there are parts of the HRE, namely Hamburg and Saxe Lauenburg, who would vassalize. Yeah, I mean, they would. And that's really weird. 
I don't really understand how that works there, but I guess because because I had done I I'd done the what is what's it called the revoke the, the privilege, I'd done that before they existed, um, because I forced Denmark to release them. So I guess somehow there's a thing like that. Uh, and oh look, we could do this, but I will not, because with our vassals we have a giant army. Speaking of giant army, before we go to war with the Ottomans, in the next episode, um, oh yes, oh then their manpower is like super low. Oh guys, this is going to be amazing. And <laughs> Portugal is our vassal, uh, Milan is our vassal, Netherlands is our vassal, vassal Austria is our vassal. <laughs> Uh, ooh! Oh my gosh. Wait, is it time? Is it time? Uh, no, it's not time. Another 22 years. Damn. Um, alright guys, well I will see you in the next episode. And, uh, yeah, the world's looking, looking pretty much ours. Uh, cause what's actually hidden in this is the, uh, in this diplomatic view for us, is the colonial nations of our vassals and PU subjects, which is all of this green, all of the orange. Um, so that's actually a pretty huge chunk of everything. See you next time.